Up next on Aslan Media's Threatened and Endangered Species, the San Francisco Garter Snake. The threatened San Francisco garter snake has been on the endangered species list since 1967 and is native to San Francisco, San Mateo, and down to Santa Cruz. There may only be a couple thousand of these snakes, however they are hard to find as they tend to hide or run when encountering humans, so it is not known for sure the exact number of living specimens. These snakes are considered harmless to humans. These pretty snakes grow to be between one and a half and four and a half feet in length and weigh five ounces. They have vibrant red, black, and light blue stripes running down the length of their lean bodies and typically have a red or orange head. These snakes don't have teeth, instead they have venomous saliva. These snakes typically live in wetland areas near ponds with thick plant life, usually on hillsides where they enjoy basking in the sun. They will use new, old, and non-permanent bodies of fresh water and are rarely seen near bodies of salt water as part of their prey are freshwater animals. During the summer, when ponds and other bodies of water dry up, these snakes will use other animals' burrows to go into a dormant state, and during the winter near the coast, these snakes will hibernate. However, in the more interior part of the state, these snakes may be active all year round. Mating occurs between April and June, and the females give birth to 16 or so live young between July and September. Threats to these snakes include loss of habitat due to roadway construction, farms, dredging, human disturbance, pesticides, poaching, and decline in food sources. Other threats include bullfrogs, hawks, herons, other snakes, and cats. The San Francisco garter snake likes to dine on things like lizards, frogs, toads, mosquitoes, fish, worms, and young bullfrogs. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you would like to know more about a specific species, please let me know in the comments below.